Sunday, new week, let's begin. Here's a life hack for you. Next time you... Next time you default to some negative self-talk, replace it with something positive. Here's an example. Oh, I'm a tube. A tube is a silly person. Oh, I'm a tube. Do something wrong. Oh, I'm a tube. Replace it with, oh, I'm a lotus flower. See how that changes your life. Oh, I'm a lotus flower. I'm a lotus flower. Give it a go. Look at that Monday morning. Look at that view of the snow. Beautiful. Awesome. Another sleepless night for Johnny Boy. I've got to do uni work today too. Wait. <clears throat> See that a bit louder. I've got to do uni work today too, so that's great. Oh well, here we go. I've got a confession to make, and despite that, I made a video on happiness. I am plagued with the. I don't want to say I'm plagued. No, it's fine. No, I was just I was just uh, unscrewing the camera from the tripod to expose my mum. She is one of the capitalists that control this zoo that we're living in. This zoo where the moon isn't real, okay? The moon is a JPEG and it gets replaced with different JPEGs and the sky, is con the weather is controlled by jets and... It's not the jets, it's the stuff that comes out the back of the jets. Aye, the stuff that comes out the back of the jets, that, you know, that... What do you call it? What, what, it's just inside their knowledge. It's just inside their knowledge, eh? Something trails. What they call it again? Yeah, the jet trail. Like chemtrails. Chemtrails are full of snow, rain, whatever, whatever weather you want. So next time you're picking up a bit of snow, it's man-made. Look at it, it's man-made. And the birds, don't get me started on the birds, they're bloody... Yeah, what were they again? They, they record. They record everything you do. They're robots. They'll just be flying yeah. TikTokers. Where did that come from again? I seen it on a meme. Oh yeah. Right. Inside their knowledge, you've heard it here first. We're living in a goddamn simulate well not simulate the Truman Show. We're basically living in the Truman Show. Managed to miss my tutorial yesterday because I am an absolute plum. So I need to have got some catching up to do. Shit. I also managed to have one of the most horrific nightmares I've experienced. Nah, not one of the most up there is pretty bad. I've probably had some worse nightmares. Um, I hate nightmares. I don't get them often but my god. And I think they're starting to get a bit more detailed nowadays. They're starting to get a bit more more like a start, middle, and end. 
makes too much sense and everything. It's horrible. Demons and everything. Demons with red glowing eyes. Not good. Not good. I need to start watching kids' cartoons or something just to keep the, the subconscious full of nice wee things. My god. Alright. It's not like I'm watching anything dodgy. My brain's just a dick. <laughs> I'm scared of myself. I'm scared of myself. So this week we're looking at the evolution, the evolution side of things. Um, they explain how in different, different hominids, no, not hominid. What do you call it? Different increased hominid brain size. Okay, hominid. Yeah, in different hominids. So you got your Homo erectus. Homo sapiens is us, Homo nidithyralinus is the, 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 the growth rate of the brain increased, um, and <sighs> the pelvises, the pelvi, so that's a chimpanzee pelvis here on the left. That's a human one on the right. Uh, Colin, oh, Colin's barking right now. Um, oh, one sec. I'll cut this. Maybe, maybe it's content. Need to give him a walk. I'm over describing it. Long story short, the human pelvis, because the human brain needs to be developed, because the human brain needs to get through the human pelvis, most of its development is done during childhood, as opposed to other, so humans have a longer childhood as opposed to other, um, uh, what's the hominids, but these aren't hominids are they? What is that? Like, what is a chimpanzee? What does a chimpanzee belong to? Stupid noob question, but a primate. Other primates, humans have the longest childhood because their brains need to fit through the pelvis. There we go. Long story short. Um, and then on top of that, there's humans have a thing called alloparenting, where it means we we have we take the use of grandparents, teachers, professional caregivers, older siblings, and other kin to look after our kids and bring them up. Um, uh, we're a social animal. Uh, and, and you know our communication's needed for, or it would have been needed for tool use. Nowadays it's needed for other things. Um, Do, do, do. Natural pedagogy. Pedagogy. Uh, this is that we use signals. We use ostensive signals to indicate in a communicative situation that important cultural knowledge is being taught. So these two are making dumplings. So she's using her hands to indicate to this wee boy what to do. So, language is transmitting cultural knowledge, basically. This wee boy's gonna be the dumpling baker, you know? He's gonna own his own baking company. All because of his gran. Call it Granny, Granny Bakers. Uh, we're highly social, we've got neuroplastic, we're quite naive during childhood, so we need care, um, and we've got certain characteristics that make us uh, careable, we're cute and we're cuddly and we'll listen, we're attentive um, I'm, I'm just pulling them out of the heart, we've not been actually told what it is, that it is how we act to elicit care but I'm sure it would be something like that 
and uh, adults act to provide care, so they've got evolved things that help them provide care. Uh, not went into that yet, I'll go into that in a moment. Cool. I, I interrupt this vlog to have a segment of me drinking a coffee and going over the news. Mmm. BBC News. Let's see what's on the, the headlines for BBC News. Uh, okay, I'm going on the home page. People in variant test areas told to think twice. Why is that? Thousands, thousands in areas where South Africa variant found should further limit time outside, a minister says. Eh. That's South Africa, that's not Scotland, I don't care. <laughs> Uh, the story of the suspected gangster at the Harrow Boxing. I watched a wee bit of that. A wee bit of gang, gang banging going on in, in the gym or associated with the gym in Marbella, Marbella. A lot of people executed. A lot of people caught, caught on camera, people being executed and uh, never been caught. Them never been caught having done the job. I'm in the middle of the process of videoing right now, mother. Oh, okay, I'm just going to grab myself a drink. Okay. Like a... uh, just a coffee. Third coffee every day. Oh. Yeah. I'm a free man. A free man drinks coffee as much as he can. Coffee is good for the soul, good for the brain. I think. I don't know what makes me really tired. It makes me crash, but. Just need my fix, you know. Uh, UK variant has mutated again, scientists say, so that's, that's relative to us, and that's not good. Just a lot of coronavirus, nothing really else. Wealthy home workers retreat to their sheds. Okay. That's what you should do, Mum, you should retreat to your shed, work in the shed. Retreat to my room, yeah, move back in. Yeah. Okay. Since I had long reads, I'm not going to read this, but since I had COVID, food makes me want to vomit. Ooh, that's a reason to wear your mask. That is a reason to... Uh, that, that's, that. COVID is serious, because I like food. I've said it before, I'll say it again, I like food, so fuck COVID. Okay, that is that rounds it up for, today, for today's segment on drinking coffee with John. On to the vlog. Turns out there is another tutorial, or another two tutorials running this week that I can go to, so that means that I am not, ah, uh, what's the word, degenerate, or I uh, was not as much as, as a degenerate as I thought, I thought I was, so yay. Or I can redeem myself from, de from degeneracy. I can de-degenerate myself. I can regenerate myself. Like a transformer. That wasn't funny. Fuck off. It was funny. No, it wasn't. Mm, mm, mm. Look at that snowing. I don't know if you can see that. Anyway, I'm just filming. And I'm just filming to see that I am basically a trade sporting character. Minus the heroin. I'm a lost boy. My every day I'm reminded that my existence is almost pointless. Like I've got the capability of I'm a bit of a, I'm a leader. Like I'm I'm genuinely like I'm no ego involved. I am a leader, that's what I do, I lead people. I bring people together, groups together. But in a capitalist society in which we live in, there is none of that. There is no leading. It's just it's a, it's a single individual process, and you get your money, and you you buy your shit, and you eat food and die, have kids die. So those leadership, that like what I am, a leader, isn't getting spent. So I've got I'm doing that as well. I'm doing that individual thing, pursuing money, which I don't really care about. 
and you know I'll get a house eventually. I'll get land eventually, and that hopefully I'll get land, and I can I can I can flex those leader that leader muscle those muscles when I've got my my eco village. But uh, for now, living in society, I'm pl like playing the game of 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 capitalism. I'm just, uh, I honestly just feel like a spare prick, like it's, it's pretty, it's shit, I can't, it's almost like, it's like I'm a car and there's a road but that I can't take, there's no road for me to take but I've got all these tools to be able to take that road but the, the road doesn't exist because we're living in a zoo. Like, if we were living in a hunter-gatherer society, I would be leading the, the hunter-gatherers, I'd be leading the tribe. So I don't really get much of a kick out of life, because... Like, obviously there's the wee things, like my dog, I like my dogs, and human interaction, I'll, you know, fucking choke for human interaction. That's dr driving me crazy by lockdown, like, there's not enough of that. Um, and this is good, I like doing this. Uh, but I can't pursue anything like that I want. That I, I can't just... I've got this ability in me and it's just annoying, it's very difficult to, to explain. But it's... So it's... <sighs> So, I'm just going to stare at the wall for a bit. Now, nah, I'll finish my new work and then stare at the wall. I'm going to cut this last bit. Uh, in the third part of this project, in this presentation, uh, we learned of dyadic interaction. So, dyadic interaction is two people, so, for example, between interaction between the mother and the, the wee one, the baby, um, and at this point, um, uh, facial expressions are involved, eye gaze, vocalisation and touch, uh, bonding, bonding is reciprocal, reciprocal, Western societies with small family units. Um, in many non Western societies, infants and children are embedded in polyadic interactions. And um, polyadic, I'm guessing, is just multiple. I'll, uh, I'll double check that for sure. Involving three or more quantities, elements, or individuals. So polyadics, more people. So. And because of that, because of the polyadic interaction, you, you learn more speech. You're, you overhear more speech from children of different ages. Um, what else did you learn in this? There's a few things I'm just going to skip. Describes children's ability to, to to understand social signals through the facial expressions and gestures, and understanding intentions. Uh, like, for example, if somebody drops something, did they drop it on accident or did they drop it um, on purpose just to be mean? Uh, learning to imitate, they've got the ability to imitate. Incorporating the environment into the interaction. What does that mean? Incorporating the environment into the reaction. Into the, uh, the reaction. I don't know 
what that means. I'm going to bear with me. How much recording time have we got? Bear with me, I'll just uh I wanna get that in my cranium. I'll I'll cut this. Okay, we got there. Um by nine to ten months infants move from dyadic interaction to triadic interaction and that means th between two people, the child and whoever, the caregiver for example, can Unless you say there's an object, they can interact, they can, uh, With each other about shared experiences, shared references in... They can interact about the object, if that makes any sense. They can... The BB, the caregiver can point at the object and the, the BB would understand that by pointing it means to that there could be a joint attention and, the, and uh, the BB can understand what the fuck's going on. <laughs> oh, my, I'm so tired. Why am I going <sighs> Or nine, ten, nine to ten month year old baby caregiver object. Mm, points at the object, baby's like, mm, looks at the object, is able to do that by nine to ten months. Incorporating the environment into the interaction. There we go. Yes. Yes. I just remembered last week I said I wasn't going to do any presentations but I wasn't going to record any presentations but any, any of the lectures that I'm doing but I am but you know what it's interesting you know if you don't find it interesting or if you think I should just scrap it give it a comment below um, but I think, it, I think it is interesting I think it's a good addition for now, it's not a permanent thing. Like if I, st I finish uni in May, and I'll I'm hope I'm I'm aiming. I will I will be going camping for a few months, proper camping for a few months. Um, and by by proper I mean like we will thoroughly camp. Um, so I'll be recording that. So, you know, the tales of John Reed, the vary, the vary. I jump in the sea. I show you some psychology. I go camping. I walk the dogs. You know? I get married, maybe. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. I'll keep this going until then. If I, if I do get... Not an if. I will get married. I will get married. But, you know, stay tuned, subscribe, because this is a lifetime. My brother or sister. This is a lifetime. Yeah. Break my shadow boxing. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Lomachenko, I'm calling you out, son. Let's do an MMA fight. Alan. First MMA fight, Lomachenko's first MMA fight. V. John Reed, come on. Bring it, son. I've got hands. I've got legs. I've got legs. Tell her. There's a head kick right there. There's another head kick. My head kick. On my left, there we go. I've got some, uh, oh, uh, that was a head kick. I've got some leg kicks. 
I've got another leg kick. Ooh. Checks. I've got plenty of checks. Elbows, you want some elbows? Son, you want some elbows? What else have I got? I've got some knees. Mmm. Mmm. Uh, spinning back kick's not the best, but it's a working process. Pro pro process. Working progress. Oh. What else have I got? Some of the ground. Lomachenko, you cannot handle my ground game, son. Oh, you're on the ground? You're on the ground? Come on! Come on! I've got those jiu-jitsu skills to a degree, but I'm not going to show you them. They're a secret, because they're terrible. Nah, nah they're there. What else have we got? I think that's, that's me covered in MMA. On the cage. Got that. Could do with some work. What else have I got? On the cage, on the ground, wrestling, MMA wrestling. Got a wee bit of that. Got my hands, got all the striking. What else is there? What else is there? Mm. Mm. Right in the bus. Right in the bus. Oosh. Distance range. I've got some karate in me. I've got some karate in this, in these sleeves, son. Uh, that's it. That's it. And I've got will and power and determination, strength. Well, Lomachenko, bring it, son. You know, I say I'm a car and I've not got a road to drive on, but one road I can drive on is mixed martial arts. So. You know, well, stay tuned. And I know there's a lot of people, maybe a few subscribers that aren't really into MMA, and I try and keep my videos separate. But uh, stay tuned because I might start training. I'm gonna get into kickboxing once lockdown lockdown is over. Get back into that, and then I'll be training MMA later on. So stay tuned. You might see some fights. John Reed v whoever the fuck, whoever. Doesn't matter, I'll take them all.